Well, I'm not dead, but I do have a boner. Did you use the word smart? Don't ever use the word smart with me. Don't ever use that word. Oh, give me a break. Because you know what? There's nothing smart about you, Joe. Negative. He created them because the Navy needed more janitors. Where you at, easy? One to go. Now. Reality can be whatever I want. Okay, so is, is this what I need to do? This is what you want to see? You want me to shut up? Yes, Brian Skeen! I need you to shut the fuck up and stop FaceTiming me while I'm out on black leave! Go ask one of your other NCOs! God damn it! Men, you have to start making noise in bed. I see one thirty roll the dial the strip on your left rock steady woo rock steady eighty second and we're on a one way trip on your left rock steady woo rock steady. What was your unsupervised childhood activity that definitely should have killed you? This. It was this. Some people ask me, Grace, why do you yell so much? <laughs> It's because if I didn't, I would have a complete mental breakdown every single goddamn day. Every day. There are only 24 hours in the day. I can't do it all, so I'd yell to relieve my stress. <laughs> Works great. You should try it. Hey, guy. Why are you only five minutes early? Oh, oh there, there was traffic? Okay. How about you do push-ups? Uh, yo, bro, you, you, you can't do that, like, here, like, that's... Like, not a thing. <laughs> what do you- what do you mean I can't do that here? Ooh, I wonder what this does! <laughs> I'm in danger! I'm not afraid anymore! <laughs> I'm not an angry person. But I don't care if you're cold, tired, or hungry! Get to work! Is this appropriate? I I feel like this is appropriate. All right, I'm I'm just gonna rock this. Yeah, let's go. Often told I have a drill sergeant voice, so I looked up some drill sergeant quotes, and I'm gonna yell them for you guys, so you can uh, see what it would look like if I actually was a drill sergeant. <clears throat> I want that toilet seat so clean I can make a sandwich on it. You have ten seconds to get in my formation! Ten, nine, four, two, one! On your faces! Who taught you how to count? Start from zero! Not one, zero! Oh, I came home to let my dogs out and pet their face. I hope when I see him, I don't find that they shit all over the place. Baby, get red. Fuck! Yeah, it's range day today. Let's go! Range walk hardcore! Before I send you back to remedial! Let's roll! Step it out! Ever since a coronavirus, I've become ninja. I wear a mask. I hide in the bush. And I lay in wait to attack. Aye! Join the army, they said. And do cool training, they said. Hang out at a beach all day and get like some mimosas all day, they said. What you <laughs> recruiting isn't that bad. I need your help. I can't tell you what it is. You can never ask me about it later, and we're gonna hurt some people. Who's car we gonna take? Oh, motherfuckers! Always running y'all's motherfucking mouth! Get your ass over here, mister! Oh, yeah! Pull over! I'm right here, you triple-looking motherfucker! Do at this if you've ever been a drill instructor or a drill sergeant. But just so you know, I'm not as scared of you anymore. Ha! They're looking at me right now, aren't they? Yes. 
Have you ever caught a recruit doing an impersonation of you during boot camp? I never caught one, no, I'm very scary, but I've been told that they have made them of me. Did you ever have someone's mom hit on you at graduation? No, but I've hit on others' moms and girlfriends and sisters, definitely sisters. Have you ever had a recruit just lose it and go nuts? Yes, and I checked that shit quick. What's the best advice you'd give somebody who's going to boot camp? Volunteer for everything. If I was a recruit, you wouldn't yell at me, would you? Shut up and make some TikTok cringe, I'm kid. Uh, <laughs> Lastly, do you miss that job? I still do it. And this isn't a question. I just want to thank you for doing that job. You're some of the best examples of the U.S. military. Don't thank me. Thank you, recruiter. I think it's time for you to lose some weight, fatty. That's what it is. Hey, you can't talk to my grandson like that. Someone ought to put you in a mental hospital. Someone should put you in a box floating down the river, Grandma. I'm your obnoxious neighborhood crackhead, Ricky, and there may be a hurricane going on. I'm gonna make sure I'm gonna lay in the middle of the street and make you late for work, and I will refuse to get up until you give me a dollar. It's a crackhead toll. <laughs> and just explain that to your boss. <laughs> give me a dollar. One. <laughs> I'm in the cavalry. <laughs> Yeehaw! Why don't you let me lick your butthole? <laughs> Feels like somebody wants to sell me something! <laughs> I told you he was on to us! <sighs> Boy, that escalated quickly. I mean, that really got out of hand fast. It jumped up a notch. It did, didn't it? Yeah, I stabbed a man in the heart. I saw that. Brick killed a guy. Did you throw a trident? Yeah, there were horses and a man on fire, and I killed a guy with a trident. You're asking for a pretty high salary for someone who has no experience in this field. Well, this job is gonna be pretty hard since I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. That is the scariest fucking thing I have ever seen in my entire life. I love you. I love you too, man. I love you. We I'm can't... so glad that we be, we stayed friends. Yeah, me too. Like that we became friends and we've remained close. I know. This is the funnest relationship. This is so much better than my marriage. <laughs> I just want to say from the bottom of my heart, I'd like to take this chance to apologize to absolutely nobody. The double champ does what the f he wants. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I won't do it no more. <laughs>